wish you were here Wish you made a call you when you turn me on The way you tell me you want me down Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I go by Just H. Please like if you like the content and subscribe. Subscribe right now. Right now. Okay, so guys, um, this is a travel vlog. I'm in Greece, we just landed. So it's my birthday on Friday, I'm turning 30. Um, I'm turning 30, so yeah, my boyfriend's taking me to Greece for my 30th birthday. Super excited. We're in Crete, we're in Heracleon, we just landed. Our flight was at 6 a.m., so we haven't slept. We headed to the airport around 2 a.m. Um, checked in and stuff like around four, flight at six. So I haven't slept, really, really tired, but also like very, very happy and excited to be here. You know the vibes, it's gonna be lit, it's gonna be good vibes. And the plan now is to get an Uber to Akasha. Akasha I'm really excited to stay at because I feel like it's a beautiful hotel. I will show you like everything. Yeah, so that is the plan. But I definitely feel like some sleep will be good. Even if though, you know sometimes when you're like excited and stuff, you're like, oh, I don't need to sleep. Yeah, I feel like I should. So definitely sleep for a few hours. Yeah, so I can get ready for this holiday. We are here till Monday. So we fly out like late on Monday. Basically early hours of, um, no, it's like Monday night, like 11 o'clock. So that's good for us because we can make the most of our time here, especially because we fly in the evening, we can do stuff in the day as well. But yeah, I'll show you the hotel. But before I show you the hotel, guys, if you haven't subscribed, if you haven't subscribed and you like my content, because I'm not, you know, I'm not gonna force anyone against their own will. If you don't like my content, please don't subscribe. We want good vibes. If you like my content and you enjoy it and you wanna be like notified when I post and stuff like that, just press the subscribe. Just press the subscribe. Go on, go on, you know you wanna, go on. Um, but yeah, so plan is, <laughs> the plan is to call the Uber and yeah, I'll take you guys with me. Um, so we got some food from they have a shop just by us they were really nice really friendly like good customer service so just got some like lamb chops and chips we are gonna eat that and nap actually i think i'll do a little tour of the hotel and then sleep hi guys it's quite dark in here as in my sunglasses my plan is to look around the hotel but also show you guys what the hotel looks like so i'll do a little bit of that just a little walk around a little tour so i know where everything is Um, we're going for dinner now. The dinner actually finishes at 9 30, which is so so early. Um, right now it's 9 15 because we napped and then getting ready took some time. So, yeah, we're gonna go and try and see if they will still let us in. Not let us in, but if there's still food, hopefully. <laughs> I get I got some tacos which looks really nice guys the plate looks a bit mad but it hopefully will taste better some tacos some noodles some onions there uh, pepper a pork and some roast beef it looks a bit crazy but I trust it the buffet looks really good so I have some taco tacos 
That's um, called beef and that's chorizo, which is apparently really nice. So we'll find out. We woke up quite late, so I'm going downstairs to try and attempt and get some food to get some breakfast. Um, the full English breakfast finished at 10, so I'm very upset. Like me and full English. Um, but hopefully, I can get like the intercontinental. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but yeah, I'll keep you posted on my ventures. Did I do okay? Would you like anything? Uh, one, three, one, eight. Hey guys, um, we're going to the gym now. With this um, hotel, you have to book slots. So earlier we booked the 2.30 slot. Um, as I was saying, you have to book for the gym. So you have to book like a day before, actually on the day. And um, we booked a slot for 2.30. So we've just kind of been waiting for this slot. Um, but it's nice because you have the whole gym too, like yourselves, which is good. The breakfast was good, but it was a bit greasy. It was a bit greasy for me. That's just me being real. The dinner was much better. The dinner was so delicious, like it was amazing. Um, so I'm hoping that the dinner is good today. But yeah, the plan is to probably go to the gym. We're going to try the indoor pool, hopefully. Get some lunch and then get ready for dinner. So today's kind of been like a restful day, even though that wasn't the plan. But it's been very quite chill. And then tomorrow, it's a new day. So we'll see. Stay tuned. But we're definitely going to have... Um, going to try and find like an excursion to do. And like more activities, I think. I forgot to vlog. Yeah, but we basically got room service after going to the gym and then after we'll go to the swimming pool. So we're going to the indoor pool now. Morning guys. Um, we're going to breakfast. Running a bit late. Um, but I will show you what the food that they have and I will take videos because yesterday I didn't take videos because I was rushing so I'll do that today Oh, a little shortcut I didn't take this one yesterday oh yeah, also it's my birthday daytime outfit let's see how it actually looks together but this is the daytime outfit before i change for like the kind of evening early evening outfit but yeah i will show you when i have it on this is today's a drink hey guys we're walking to king scorpio better with my um, sunglasses on because my eyes were doing shakara because i've had a couple shots i think technically eight shots i'm walking to king scorpio my boyfriend had to go back because he forgot something in the hotel room but it's only like a four minute walk so it makes more sense for me to go there see what they're saying because apparently you need to reserve but yeah this is the creek streets so i'm very brave with my camera but i think it's fine holidays like this i'm like i need to travel more there's so much more than the uk shitty weather so yeah but as you can imagine naturally i'm a bit lit um, I'm 30 today. My experience so far is that I really like Greece. Um, naturally, I say naturally a lot, but like, I feel like as a black woman, you might be a bit cautious of going to like different countries, um, experiencing racism. You know, it's just the thing that comes with the prototype. It's just, it's just what it is. Like, if you don't go, to, if you don't think about traveling and think about like your ethnicity, then that's a privilege in itself. So those are things that you think of. Um, but being in Greece, it's been great so far. Um, it's been wonderful. I feel like I haven't experienced any discrimination or people making me feel a type of way. I've really enjoyed my time. I am three days in. 
but from this experience i feel like i could come here again and reach the destination hopefully it's quiet oh my gosh that was so dark i might tell them it's my birthday um see if that does anything but yeah i'll just walk like this hotel now we're getting more drinks because my boyfriend wants to you know finish me um, yeah so we both got zombies and then the guy at the bar said he'll give me some shots because it's my birthday and these are the shots what you waiting what? something to yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh. guys I've just come back to the hotel and they have laid this out for me which is so sweet thank you Akasha Hi guys, we're going to Med Cafe now. We're a bit late, um, like 30 minutes late. So hopefully we can still get in, as if it's a club, but you know what I mean, we can still get our table. If not, we'll go to another restaurant on the coast. Cause they have loads. Um, but Med Cafe looked really nice. I actually saw it on TikTok. I'm not really into TikTok, but I was convinced by Sarah, I gave it a little browse and found this cafe called Med Cafe, which is really nice. <laughs> I have one on the side. Oh, uh, sorry. That's okay. Thank you. Yeah. Sorry. The celebration goes on. Guys, we're trying to find um, somewhere they're still like serving like alcohol and stuff. But it looks like everywhere's actually opened. The roads are still open. Still on the venture. We're trying to find Hennessy or Cavossier. Yes. No luck so far. <laughs> Guys, we're still searching for a brown drink. Hennessy or Cavossier. I said that he shouldn't be picky, that he should just get any brown drink, but he refuses. So this is such, but I do like that everything's open and it's like 11 o'clock, so that's also a perk. If you're ever in Greece, Heracleon to be precise, just know that if it's midnight and you're hungry, there's gonna be food, you can get a lot of stuff. My face looks really oily, but this is like how many hours of makeup, so we move. Hey guys, um, today is October the 1st, Saturday, October the 1st. It's the day after my birthday. Guys, I had the best, best, birthday i'm still drunk um yeah i had so much fun 30 living we thank god for a new year and all his blessings that he's blessed me with and are to come so very very grateful um but yeah yesterday we were at med cafe guys med cafe i don't want to use my hands because my hands are dry but med cafe 10 out of 10 like the customer service was amazing they made us feel so special they were really attentive to everything food was good drinks was good just good vibes good energy so if anyone's ever in Crete, Heracleon go to Med Cafe like 
everyone was nice everyone had good vibes like you know sometimes in the restaurant you have that like everyone likes everyone's nice and you have that one like bitch <laughs> someone that's just like not happy to be there no everyone was nice so definitely go to med cafe they spoke about closing for the season so they said from today they're just gonna be doing drinks but yeah definitely 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 recommend like that's amazing but yeah today's a rest day i'm gonna get some breakfast i don't think i'll film breakfast because you've seen it for the last five days the last four days but um gonna get some breakfast and rest and chill um and then also find out about the excursions because i was thinking about doing jet skiing but they're talking about going through mountains and i don't like heights that's not a secret like i don't like heights i feel like we should be on the ground um and they're talking about you know not jet skiing sorry quad biking quad biking through mountains it's not like jet skiing through mountains quad biking through mountains so basically you want to find out what you really mean by that um and then if so we'll book it for tomorrow but yeah i'll see you guys in a bit refill every day okay if you don't like something and you prefer something else you can leave a dot note so i can see it in the morning okay Hey guys, we're just on our way to dinner. Um, this is a different restaurant this time. Um, they have two re restaurants. So this one's the a la carte restaurant. So we're going to try the food for the first time and see. Today we're going quad biking, so we're literally waiting for the car to come pick us up. Yesterday I wasn't feeling well, my stomach was doing a lot. Could be the shots, could be something like ate, who knows? But um, yeah, we're out today, we move and we're leaving tomorrow, so we have to make the most of it today. This is the salt of water. So if you look at these small things, that was, that's a stalagmite, okay? So that's water coming down, and in some places, the tour now so we've just had some food and we'll be heading back but yeah the tour was really 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 good i definitely recommend safari desert as an excursion because the guy was really nice showed us around very informative um what did we do went to the olive we stopped at the olive like factory um where else did we stop 
went to the caves and I, you know, um, confronted some fears, which I'm proud of. And now we stopped to have some lunch and now we're going to be going back. So yeah, it's been great. It's been fun. Definitely recommend. I'll put all the details below if I can find it like online and stuff. But yeah. Today is our last day. Um, we're just on our way to the go-kart track, which is literally here. It's so hot. Our flight is like really late. It's like 11 o'clock, 11 p.m. But we're trying to make the most of the last day here. So we're just gonna go go-kart in and maybe chill by the pool, have some dinner, um, and then get ready to go to the airport. If anyone chooses to stay at Akasha, it's literally a 10 minute walk from Akasha to this place. So that's good to know, it's just really, 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 really hot. Awesome. 